This week on Balloon Busters, we're going to see if we can make a piñata out of a helium balloon, exploding the goodies high up into the air. Which means the piñata will make a big bag of the goodies inside of it, rocketing out from the sky. What kind of stuff are we going to put in it? Chocolates. That's a great idea. And how about something to flood it out? Like confetti? Perfect. Let's go round up what we need. Here are the balloons, with the helium cylinder over there. And I brought the confetti. And we brought the chocolates. We should test them first, don't you think? An excellent idea. I'm in flavour for that. Mm, this one tastes really nice. This one too. I'm not really sure about this one. I better have another one to check. As you can see, we take our research development very seriously, like really seriously. However, after thorough testing, we've all agreed that this is the best brand. Are you sure we're going to get sponsorship for this? I'd settle for a few free boxes. What do you think? Yeah! Where are the others? Putting chocolates in the balloon. Uh. One for the balloon, one for me. One for the balloon, one for me. I like this job. Me too. What's keeping those guys? Must be harder than we thought, getting all those chocolates into the balloon. There you go. The chocolates are inside the balloon. Two for each of us. Some inside us too. What? Never mind. Fill up with gas. Gas on. Gas on. I hope the chocolates don't make it too heavy. But they did. Wow. Now what do we do? Hold it up or something, and then we'll see how much chocolates explode out. I've got my dart ready. Okay, stand back. Here we go. Oops, overthrow. Wow. Sorry, yeah. pussycat. Oh, can't hit the balloon next time. I wonder how far the chocolates can fly. How much will the vet fill be? Find out in the next explosive episode of Balloon Busters. Why are you disgusting? Seriously. However, we've all agreed that this is the best brand. We take our research development very seriously. However, after thorough testing, 